Hi friends! Today we have a new spider in the house. No, not this one. We are talking about the brand new TiVo Tarantula Pro 3D printer. The announced print volume is 235 by 235 by 250 millimeters. So, let's start the unboxing. Hey you guys! Let's take everything out first and then we will see the parts in detail. First is this bag with tools and memory card. We have here many bags with parts and screws. All of them are labeled and the manual indicates all the items that each bag contains. There is also this bag with spare screws and nuts. Next, we have the X carriage and hot end mount plate. The right side Z carriage plate. The extruder. The hot end assembly. the heat pad and the print surface the y-axis carriage more bags with screws and parts we will show these in detail in a few minutes the left side Z carriage the stepper motors here we have three of them This one includes the gear, so this one will be used for the extruder. And a few metal profiles. These are 20 by 40. And these are 20 by 20. On the bottom layer we have the main board some PLA filament more bags with parts Here we can find the stepper motor and Y-axis motor mount plate. This is the power supply unit. Next we have the front plate of the printer. The power cord. belts, a couple of PTFE tubes, a USB cable, a spatula, a needle to unclog the nozzle, and the TiVo card. A 
at the side we have the display the display flat cable and more metal profiles inside this one we can find the lead screw All of these are 20 by 40 millimeter profiles. And these are all the parts. Now let's check them in detail. This is the main board. It comes installed in this enclosure and it's already connected. All the wires that connect to the screw type connectors have ferrules on them. And the cables have tags that identify them. For the main power, we have this XT60 connector. The board is an MKS Gen L board with four replaceable Allegro drivers. There is also an extra connection for the auto level sensor. The sensor is not included, but the connection is available. For the stepper motors, this first one will be used for the extruder as it comes with the extruder gear. These two will be used for the X and Z axis. And this last one will be used for the Y axis. This one is a bit bigger compared with the other motors. The hot end comes already assembled and it's very similar with the TiVo flash one. And it's also a volcano type. The difference is on the heat break. This one, the PTFE tube, will go all the way down to the nozzle. For layer cooling, it has a couple of fans on the sides. The extruder is the famous Titan extruder. The power supply is a 24 volt, 8.5 amp model. And it's equipped with the switch, power connector and the XT60 connector. The heat bed comes with the print surface not glued on. It includes the strain relief to secure the heat bed cable and insulation on the bottom side. Inside bag labeled A01, we have the printer's feet. Inside bag A02, we have the screws, spacers, and nuts for the display. In bag A03, we have a pulley and parts for the idler. In bag A04, we have the screws and T-nuts to secure the front panel. Inside bag B01, we have the screws to secure the metal profiles. In bag B02, we have wheels, eccentric nuts, spacers, and screws. In bag B021, we have the springs and leveling nuts for the bed. In bag B03, we can find the lead screw nut, a pulley, and more screws. In bag B031, we have the assembled end stops. In bag B04, we have more wheels, bearings, and screws. In bag B041, we have more wheels, eccentric nuts, and screws. Inside bag B042, we have the top lead screw bearing and mount plate. This plate is a printed one. And inside bag B07, we have the coupling and support mount for the Z stepper motor. The bag with spare screws has many different screw types, nuts and washers. And finally, inside the bag labeled Tools, we have Allen keys, a wrench, zip ties, and memory card. Inside the memory card, we can find a few files which includes a few models to print and a very detailed manual in PDF format. Next, we have the front plate 
of the printer that comes in green color. The Y-axis carriage This is the Y-axis stepper motor mount plate This is the right Z carriage plate This is the X-axis carriage And this is the Hunnant mount plate and the left Z carriage that comes already assembled. And now for the metal profiles, we have a couple of 424 mm 20 by 40 profiles, a 400 mm 20 by 40 profile. Next, we have a couple of 350 mm 20 by 40 profiles, a small 250 mm 20 by 40 profile and a 345 mm and a 330 mm 20 by 20 profiles. So this is everything that's inside the Tivo Tarantula Pro package. Next, we will assemble everything and test it. But that is for a different video, so stay tuned for the detailed assembly very soon. Thanks for watching and don't forget to follow us here on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. If you want to help the channel, you can with Patreon or PayPal. We will see you guys next time. Bye!